Welcome back. A World War II airplane crash landing in the ocean right off of Cocoa Beach. People in the water and on land lucky to be alive. And tonight, some people are comparing that pilot to Captain Sully. Remember him? He's the pilot who landed a plane on the Hudson River more than a decade ago. Fox 35's Lyra Greenberg has more on that. It's not every day that the Cocoa Beach Air Show becomes a Cocoa Beach Water Show. Oh. But eyes turned from the skies to the sea Saturday when one of the World War II airplanes in the show made an emergency landing due to a mechanical issue. We were all very surprised and amazed at what took place on Saturday. Organizer Chris Dorado says it became clear pretty quickly that the pilot, the only person on board, was okay. He got out of the plane and waved to the crowd on the beach to let them know that he was fine. No one on the ground hurt either. They train for these sort of things all the time. It wasn't an airliner, but it was reminiscent of the Sully uh, landing, uh, the Hudson River landing uh, that we all remember way back when. The only thing that did suffer damage, the plane itself. Dorado says it was recently restored and now it'll be torn apart to find out what went wrong. According to the Valiant Air Command Facebook page, it will likely take years to rebuild. But things could have been a lot worse. Once we knew the pilot was, was fine, which was pretty quickly, you know, we were able to continue the show. The FAA and NTSB are now investigating. In Cocoa Beach, Lyra Greenberg, Fox 35 News.